What is the worst dog breed for people with families? Now, as a canine behaviorist, I work with literally thousands of people with families that are struggling with behaviors with their dogs. So I see the same behaviors cropping up in the same breeds for similar reasons. And one of the most common breeds I see families struggling with is the Border Collie. Doesn't mean that they're a bad dog, but for me, Border Collies were bred to herd and have incredible high energy outputs. People with especially young families are very rarely able to provide the exercise that is required. And in a household where you've got erratic kids running around, it triggers that herding instinct in a collie. And I've lost count of people that have issues with their collies, of their dogs herding their children, which unfortunately often means them nipping at the back of their feet and legs. And is obviously something that you want to avoid at all costs.